10 years ago, coming out of the Ren Fair at Kearney Park. I was getting back in the car with the family and there's something tucked on the windshield. And as I started to throw it away, I said, whoa, what is that? And it says, you inaugural season of the Woodward Shakespeare Festival, founded by S. Eric Day and Brandon Weiss, Much Ado About Nothing and Romeo and Juliet. Well, we went down, auditioned, we were cast, and been involved off and on in various capacities since then. And for the last three years now, I've been the executive producer. We're the Woodward Shakespeare Festival. We are a nonprofit community theater company operating right here out of Woodward Park. We've been doing so now for 10 years. We started the first couple of seasons over in the Rotary Amphitheater. Uh, then we moved into the activities area just off of the Zen Garden. And for the last four years now, we've been right here in our own space, which we have a 25 year lease on to develop for the enjoyment of the, the Fresno community. The primary goal of the Woodward Shakespeare Festival is to provide the highest quality theater possible, free, for the enjoyment of everyone in the Fresno area, regardless of income, anybody who wants to be able to come out here and see the best play that they can see, we're going to provide them. And that's our mission, that's what we do. Everything else is secondary to that. sheds his blood with me this day shall be my brother and those in England shall hold their manhood cheap whilst any speaks who fought with us upon St. Crispin's Day yeah! talent uh, that we have is drawn from the local area we draw almost everything directors uh, tech people house people actors everything comes right out of this area it's amazing hot bit of talent around and we take advantage of it this is the fourth time that I've auditioned for the festival. This is the first time I made it in, so I was really, really excited about it. And this is either my sixth or seventh year performing. I'd have to count back. Macbeth shall sleep no more! It's not so These days must not be thought of these ways, so it will make us mad. You unbend your noble strength to think so brain sickly of these things. Go, get some water. Wash the filthy witness from your hands. Go! Smear the sleepy grooms of blood. Throughout the off season, roughly October through April, uh, we do a series of either staged readings or discussions or uh, film theater comparisons of plays that we're doing. Uh, this last year we did a music competition for local high school students and the winner of that competition uh, will be, her music will be featured in our upcoming production of The Tempest. And how is the baby? The baby will come before morning. Well, the doctor told me to come home and get a little shut eye. Do you mean that we are to be alone here? Yep. It's me and you, Blanche. Unless you got someone hit under the bat. Also through Fresno Pacific University, uh, with whom we have a partnership, uh, we're doing something called the Yes Project, Youth Engaged Shakespeare, and Julia Reimer, one of our uh, wonderful people, and a uh, theater arts uh, professor there at uh, Fresno Pacific. She corrals a group of kids who will then take one of our summer plays, they will improvise, they will riff on that, and they will put together their own production, which they work on for about four weeks, and they come out here and they have a uh, performance for friends and family and our audience. Uh, those are our two primary things at, uh, at this time, partnership with the uh, libraries and partnership with Professor Pacific. So it came to pass that Tanya waked and straightway loved it! <laughs> this falls out better than I could devise. great thing about this organization is its absolute drive to succeed. 
Most nonprofits don't last. Most theater companies don't last. You put those two things together and you get an organization that doesn't last. And we're still here after 10 years. What we need to be, though, is further along than we are. We've gotten very, very good at maintaining, at doing very solid shows, at doing good work. But we do need some help to get to the next level, to push to improving the lighting, to push to improving the stage, so that we can take our productions that are already good and make them better. And that's what we're here for, is to make the best thing that we can make.